got like a little cubby you can drive your trash cans through. So you got a fenced yard. Yay for that. Paint looks good. Inside's really cute. Little cover porch area. Okay, when you come in the front door, there's a spot for your pool table. The flooring is a tile. It's really clean and nice. No popcorn ceilings. Cute light fixtures. I mean, it looks pretty good so far. Okay, kitchen. Good cabinetry, soft clothes. Appliances look like new, they're in great condition. It's cute, really cute. Okay, got pantry over here. Let's go this way. Master. It's a pretty decent size. We've got a slider here. The slider has been upgraded. It's a newer one. Kind of overlooking the pool and the patio here. Got a walk in closet. This is probably five by seven. Okay, here's the master bath. It is one sink. It's a different flooring in here. The rest, this bedroom flooring is the same as the living room and the kitchen's all the same. Again, this is a tile. Shower's nice, really nice. They did a good job. Construction-wise, it looks good. I know it's only one sink though. Sorry, you can hear my flip flops today. <laughs> I apologize for that. All right, so going back to the kitchen, this is the hallway that goes back to the front door, and then that's the garage. We'll go there. Actually, we'll go there now. I like all the hardware too that they have. Okay, here's the garage. There's some hurricane shutters for you there. Washer and dryer are out here. We've got an AC and hot water heater. Let's see how old these are. No dates on that, but it looks pretty good. And let's see if there's a date on this one. No date on that either. They're all just serial numbers, which makes it a little harder. It doesn't look that new. Not this little surfboard table. It's so cute. Okay, going back this way. So this is your second living space besides the what you have up front with the pool table. So you've got this kind of like living room, family room situation, however you want to call that, and then you have another here as well. So I kind of like that layout, to be honest. It's kind of open and you still have separate spaces. Again, this tile is continued through the whole rest of the house, all the bedrooms and everything. It's very seamless. I like that. So you've got bedroom, first uh, guest room over here. This is not super big. I'd say it's probably 10 by 11. And then you go down here towards the hallway. This is like an exposed brick wall. 
and they painted it white. Okay, then you have, let's see, another bedroom over here. This one's a tad bit bigger. This is probably 12, 11 by 12, something like that. Just a regular size closet. And then here is another bedroom. Another like 11 by 11, 11 by 12. Regular sized double closet. And the next room. <laughs> this is the biggest of the, of the guest rooms. This one's probably 14 by 11. It's a little bit longer than the other ones. And this one faces the backyard. Okay, so you've got a kind of a, just to go back over, you've got a bedroom here. And then when you turn around and go down the hallway, you've got one, two, three more. So like these three are in a cluster and that one's kind of separated besides the master that's on the other side of the house. So you've got a linen closet here going into the bathroom. This one has a double sink and this is beautiful. This looks really cool. I bet it, it doesn't show in the video, but it's really it looks really nice. Okay, so regular tub, and it looks like they just went and redid the walls. Again, I like all the fixtures that they chose. They're very modern. Let's stand back here. And then there's a door here that is your pool door. So this is your pool bath. So here's your patio. It's actually really large. This would be a great Airbnb. Uh, looks like you've got some pre plum here if you wanted to do a sink and maybe put uh, some kind of grill situation out here, like a summer kitchen. Now this slider looks into that second living room that has the brick wall. That's your kitchen window. This slider goes to the dining room that overlooks the front tell what's in there and then that slider is the master okay and you've got kind of a wood ceiling here that they painted white it looks really nice and clean the floor looks really nice and clean you've got a doggy door here that goes out to your fenced yard and the fence is kind of a mix of you've got some pvc on the sides and then you've got wood on the other on the back and this other side so that's probably the neighbor's fence so you've got a little side yard here with some green space and then there's more green space over back that way and i'll walk that way in a second and I like how much pool deck here you have between the house and the, the porch. A lot of times are like you just have a little bit of a space. It's really tight, but this gives you like a lot of room to run around through here. The roof looks beautiful. Everything looks really clean and fresh. They did a nice job here. So they have rock going around the fence here and rock in the back. And then they've got grass over there again. Here's your pool pump. Pretty basic. Pool surface is fine. I don't see any like major fitting, but it's not, it hasn't been recently um, redone. You can tell it's not like, it's not there, quite there yet. Okay. So they've got like, what could be like a little fire pit right here. You can throw some more chairs. They have landscape all around the house, which with these um, landscape liners, those and that ones, they look really nice. I like this house. It's probably the best one that we that I've looked at for you guys. A lot of water hoses here. A 
Okay, I'll just walk back through one more time. And I'll send the video over to you.